Something interesting just arrived today. Let's cut it open and see what it is. It's from uh, iFixit. We got a Steam Deck fan kit. Guys are off there. Here it is. This is the Huaying fan. This is the upgrade from the Delta version. Got the opening picks. All right, laying in bed. Here's the Steam Deck. So I'm just gonna pull up some Breath of the Wild. This usually gets it going pretty quick. Right now we're cold, just starting up. So we're just getting fans, starting now. Okay, it's pretty much full bore now. Let's go put in the Huaying fan. So let's power down the Steam Deck here. So we can get this fan swapped. And as always, the best way to take apart the Steam Deck is to put it in to the case. So that way the thumbsticks are protected. Get my trusty iFixit toolkit here. Let's take it apart. I will use a zero bit. That seems to have good tension. And it's always good to keep track of all your screws. Okay, all the screws are out. Get the case popped apart. Just be very careful as you remove the sides. Rule number one, remove your SD card. Yikes. Okay. All right, the deck is apart. So here's our fan. And I take it out already. Here is the replacement fan. This is the Huaying one. It doesn't say it on there, but I think that's their logo. So that's how we know. Now my fan makes some noise because it's the Delta fan. But it's not necessarily bad. It just, you know, kind of has that little high-pitched singing noise to it. Some of the others that have taken this apart, they say to just pull up on this and remove this sticker. And then there's two screws in here that hold it in and the plate. So... And you don't even need to take this off from what I've been seeing. Now for me, it's not a big deal to take this off. I've taken it off many times for my eGPU stuff. So I might just go ahead and take it off anyway. That way we could get a better look at everything too. Okay. There's that. But let's do the, undo these screws first. So we'll take this one off. And we'll take this one off. And we'll peel that. There we go. And then that just pulls off real easy. So here's the Delta fan. Um, it's not bad. I'm going to keep it as a backup. A little bit of dust gathered on it here. But yeah, it still works well, so I'm going to keep it. And let's swap in this quieting one. There's a tiny little step notch here, so you can see that. And then that will correspond with the step notch in here. So it should go in just like this. And that's with the colored part of the wires sticking out on this side. And this side doesn't have the wires. There. 
Then we can just drop this in. Oops. Not like that. Now we can just drop this in. There we go. And make sure our wires aren't going to obstruct anything or be obstructed. And then we'll put our screws back in. Just nicely snug. Don't get too crazy. And then nicely replace this. Let's replace this shield slash heat spreader. Make sure our cord isn't going to get pinched there. Okay, that looks pretty good. And it's just these three screws because the these other two screws are part of the case. Now we can gently replace that. And that should be it. That is the fan replacement. This little flap can just kind of sit wherever because the case can cover that up. We don't need to do anything else. Inspect anything else if you'd like to, but uh, that's probably not necessary. So we'll get the cover put back on. Okay. That is the case back together. Everything seems good. Pop your SD card back in. Don't hear the fan yet, so... Let's go and do some tests. Let's do this again. Semu, Breath of the Wild. Right now the fan is off, so this is a good time to get it to ramp up again and see what it does. And volume down. Okay, that's pretty much ramped up. Here's it. And then as a test of how the uh, fan sounds when we're in a kind of louder environment and with the road mic on the camera. So there you have it. That's the install. Putting the Huaying fan in place of the Delta fan that it came with. I'll probably keep the Delta fan anyway as a backup and then just run this one. It's a little bit more pleasant to hear. A little bit less sharp on the uh, fan noise. So not too bad. Once you have the volume up, you really don't hear much of it anyway. But, but yeah, just had that quick video for you today. Thanks for watching. God bless. Take care.